Here's a quick update, what is going on with me and the studio. Okay, welcome back to the channel my friend, my name is Jose Velez from jbcreationstudio.com and if you're new here, consider subscribing. So, here it is, still a lot to be done, new design in the main acoustic panel, the walls that now are painted, the ceiling is now also paint, and the new floor, wow, a new base. So I'm gonna be showing you a couple of pictures before in a short video so you can see what was the process. painting is almost done no floor and now you can hear how it the sound without nothing nothing and not even floor so you can then do the comparison when we have the floor and then when we have the acoustic panel I'm gonna clap Real quick, let's do the clap comparison, okay? So in this section, I don't have the acoustic panel that I had to mount. So in this section, listen how it is. It's bouncing, there's nothing. This is gonna damage the recording. It's gonna go into the microphone and it's gonna be bad. So now I'm gonna clap here. I still need to put that bass strap there, but it's in the floor. So let's do the compression. Woohoo! See how dry it is? This 
this is the base try that I did that is very thick. Do it again. So when I'm recording, I'm recording in this section, which is very good. You can see I have the other here. I have the one in the top. You can now see there you go. Now you can see, see two in the top, this, this big one. And let's clap over here. See, no, it's everything I have to mount. I had three here that is covering this section. So, still, uh, there's no desk. <laughs> so now I have to figure it out how I'm gonna build the desk, but I'm still having a lot of work with because this was done in the entire house. So this being three weeks of a lot of work, not stopping, and still need to uh, do two more uh, bathroom with the guy that is doing that and I'm helping him. So I'm learning a ton, a lot. In this process, I realized that when we're doing our mixers or our song, sometimes we have to start all over, taking out, uh, really thinking what is the priority in the song. And sometimes I remember when I was taking the floor and everything out of the house. I remember starting my mixing from scratch. Really focus what is the main, what is first, what is second, what is third. So now I'm very careful of what is gonna come into, into this studio because I realized I was seven years in this setup with accumulating a lot of stuff. Some of the stuff I never use so now I'm gonna be very careful what is gonna come because the main is gonna be, you know, the acoustic panel, the painting, the desk, and then little by little, I'm gonna be bringing what I'm really gonna be using. So everything that is gonna, that is, I don't use so much, I have to find storage somewhere else because I would wanna put this, this is a small room, 10 by 10, so I don't wanna fill this with everything that I have because I have a lot, so. Whew. Wish me luck and still have a lot of work. Let me know some comment in the comment section. And I'm, when I'm, I'm still don't know what I'm gonna do with my studio desk, but I'm, oh, I'm gonna build it. But I'm, you know, a lot of work to do, so I don't know how it's gonna turn out. I hope it turned good. And sometimes we have to work on the foundation in our songs, in our mixes, and it's gonna look like a mess. Like right now, this all is this, all of this is a mess. I have a lot of stuff in the garage, in the shed. And that's good because in the long run, this is gonna be better. But right now, in this three weeks, and maybe four or five, it looked like, you know, it's a disaster. But we're working in the foundation. So sometimes you have to stop and go back and study. I remember when I was having problem with the compressor, I was stopping everything. Let me study the compressor and going to the problem with the EQ. Stop everything, hey, something wrong. Let me study again with the EQ. And going deep, so when I was going back to the mixing, it was better because I was spending more time or what this do, what this not do and, and doing a lot of practicing, doing the foundation and asking and for the one that you know they are they know what, what what is better and asking a lot of questions and taking course, finding friends that know the stuff. When I was doing the floor with the guy, he was teaching me. No, in this way. The other way, and then he was correcting me because sometimes when we do all of this by ourselves and no one is correcting us, we maybe are doing something wrong. But if you have someone that is yeah, pointing out your mistake, no, do it this way, do it this way, then you can do it. 
then you fly but if you don't have no one to correct you then you might be doing something wrong and you don't realize it so I know been talking a lot all over the place but this is what it's been this three week and I hope it's gonna be ending soon because I'm so tired but anyway I was turning the camera finding the tripod which is was hiding the camera the battery is dying I have to charge but I don't have anything here so yeah what's up us here and please leave some comments smash the like so we can keep going in this journey thank you so much see you next time let's see if i can show you a little bit of the test next time bye